Gene Jennings Bartik was an American computer programmer and one of the original six programmers of the ENIAC, the first general-purpose electronic digital computer. Born in Missouri in 1924, Bartik studied mathematics at Northwest Missouri State University before working as a school teacher. In 1944, Bartik was recruited to work on the ENIAC, which was being developed by the United States government as a tool for calculating ballistics trajectories during World War II. She was one of the first programmers of the ENIAC, and her work on the project was instrumental in its development and success. Bartik was responsible for programming the ENIAC to perform calculations for the United States Army's Ballistic Research Laboratory. She also helped to develop the software and the programming languages used on the ENIAC. After the war, Bartik continued to work with the ENIAC team and was involved in the development of the UNIVAC I, the first commercially available computer. She also worked as a programmer and analyst for the UNIVAC I and its successors. During this time, Bartik also helped to develop the programming languages used on the UNIVAC I and its successors. In the 1950s and 1960s, Bartik worked as a computer programmer and analyst in the private sector, working for various companies including Prudential Insurance and the Boris Corporation. She also continued to be active in the field of computer science and was a member of the Association for Computing Machinery and the Data Processing Management Association. Throughout her career, Bartik was a vocal advocate for the role of women in the field of computer science. She was one of the first female programmers, and her work on the ENIAC helped to pave the way for future generations of female computer scientists. Bartik was also an advocate for the inclusion of computer science in the curriculum of schools and universities, and she was involved in the development of educational programs and resources for students. In 2011, Bartik passed away at the age of 86. Her legacy continues to be felt in the field of computer science today. She was one of the first female programmers, and her work on the ENIAC project helped to pave the way for future generations of female computer scientists. Bartik's work on the UNIVAC I and her contributions to the development of programming languages also had a lasting impact on the field. Bartik's advocacy for the role of women in the field of computer science and her contributions to the development of educational programs for students also left a lasting impact. One interesting fact about Bartik is that she and the other women who worked on the ENIAC were originally referred to as computers themselves, as they performed calculations manually before the machine was fully operational, in addition to programming the machine. They were not acknowledged as programmers or computational scientists at the time, and their contribution to the project was not widely known or recognized. In recent years, Bartik and her colleagues have been recognized for their pioneering work on the ENIAC and their contributions to the field of computer science. Legacy and Contributions Today Jean Jennings Bartik was an American computer programmer who was one of the original six programmers of the ENIAC, the first general-purpose electronic digital computer. Her work on the ENIAC project was instrumental in its development and success. Bartik's work on the UNIVAC I and her contributions to the development of programming languages also had a lasting impact on the field of computer science. Bartik's advocacy for the role of women in the field of computer science and her contributions to the development of educational programs for students also left a lasting impact. Her legacy continues to be felt today, and she will always be remembered as one.